Let's watch the video and then let's react. What he said? Huh? I, I talked to. Uh, I, I am with my wife and uh, my guys, son. Guys, yeah. Guys, they are threatening us. Yeah. Guys, so uh, I think parents. they have a gun. Yeah. You heard that? They're threatening us. They think we have a gun. That's crazy. Yeah, we my wife. My wife said they have a gun. She never said that, bro. Yeah, you're a shit bag. Fuck you. You want my email? Yes. Okay. I'll send it to your number. Six plus five. No, I need it by me now. I'm not leaving. I'm not leaving until I get the full amount. How do I know? This is only four. She don't want to live. 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 Buddy, I don't care if the police come, come here. They can come. I need the police yeah, to come here. Yeah, if you guys did not do any crime, which you guys didn't, then you guys should get the money, right? So we're going to wait for the police. I don't, know, I don't know anything about what's going on. All I know is that you guys came here and asked for money, okay? And that's because it's not like a robbery where you guys are pulling a gun out. What kind of gun you have? I don't have a gun. You guys have a gun. We have messages and everything. Okay, there's more. Yes, that's him. Did you say there was a gun here? Oh, no. No, I didn't. If you don't get that bullshit out of my face, kid. Yes, or no? Yes, or no? I love you to switch this car just so you can carry on. Look how many police officers are here from what somebody said there's a gun here. Think about what you're saying. There's, look how many police cars are here. Just to try and get us to hire oh, get away from my here. Wife, okay, I didn't say. Well, who called? Maybe you should bring your you wife out about this. The... I'm asking you! Who called? I called. So who said there's a gun in here? Who said there's a gun here? Did you say it? Okay, uh, I, 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 this is a landlord yes, tenant act. It's nothing to do with the police. Who said there's a gun here? Look how many cars are here. I, I didn't say. I told them I didn't. I didn't see the boss. Yeah? Yes, that's him. Okay, so what we seen there was atrocious, despicable acts of capping. What? Large cap. The man clearly said on the phone with the cops that these niggas in the car had a gun. He said. That his wife seen them have a gun. Or he said his wife said that they had a gun. And he said that to the cops. He put it on his wife. But he said that they had a gun. And the cops arrived. And they came with all these, these units. And that's why the cop was yelling at him frustrated. Because he was trying to get a confession out of him. He's like, you said they had a gun, right? And he was saying no. He was just denying it and acting so, like it was something different. The cops brought all these units. He probably thought that they see a bunch of black men in the car. And he's calling the cops and the black men. And he said they have a gun. So these cops will come and shoot the black men without even investigating thoroughly to make sure that they do have a gun. And even if they did have a gun, they, sh they should have been searched and apprehended and not shot. But that's what they're going for. That's what they call the cops hoping for. If they know they have no gun, there's no presence of a gun. No gun has ever been entered in the equation or in the, in the situation period. It's like you say that with the intent of cops coming and drawing guns and potentially shooting these black folks. That's what you're doing. That is what you're doing. So when videos like this come out, you're, you're exposed and then you're just capping throughout the whole thing and you put it on your wife and then you try to deny it when they ask you directly. And that cop was clearly frustrated, but there has to be some sort of action that, you know, some sort of um, repercussions 
consequences for calling the cops for no reason and trying to get people hemmed up on some bullshit that you're, you're just capping. You're angry about something and you're trying to get people, you're trying to get black folks. Most, most of the times you see these things happen with black folks. I haven't even seen it ever in a video where someone tried to say, oh, there's a gun and trying to get the cops to come and shoot people. You don't ever see that really unless it's aimed and targeted at black people. And, it, and it's offensive, it's disrespectful. These type of things definitely need to be put on blast because this, these, th these type of things happen very often and they need to be put on blast because that's some bullshit. And black people aren't so quick to call the cops on other types of races of people or even black folks themselves in situations like this. And these other people call the cops to try to get the upper hand because they know there's the the fractured relationships with the cops in the black community and the amount of shootings that take place. So they try to use they try to weaponize that against black folks. And it's ridiculous. Thank you.